Meantime, a restoration project of a pathway along 26th Street is finally done. Fox has Elizabeth Alvarez live in Belleville Park with how this makes it safer for pedestrians and bicyclists. Elizabeth, good morning. Good morning. It's a great morning to be here on the border of Golden Hill and Balboa Park. That's the pathway. The project is complete. It's already being used. Look, there's a runner further yonder over there. And what a beautiful morning to celebrate this completion. It's been a project that's been underway for several years. We're talking about what was a pathway initially created by pedestrians and bikers trying to access Balboa Park. Well, guess what? Forever Balboa Park and um, another organization, the California Conservation Corps, got together and said, you know what? We're going to improve this pathway. We're going to make it wider. We're going to make it safer and easier for pedestrians bikers, residents, anyone who wants to use it. And here we are four years later and $380,000 later, it's complete. And two people who live in Golden Hill who know exactly how important this is are standing right here. I just met them, Christiana and Josh. Good morning to both of Good you. Good morning. morning. This is exciting because you all come to this park all the time. I mean, obviously you're, you're carrying bags. What do you normally do out here? Yeah, we're uh, weekly. We just come out as neighbors to take care of our neighborhood. We come pick up trash for an, about a half hour, and we have another neighbor and some some other neighbors who join us. But we're pretty faithful to come and just make this place clean and beautiful for all the neighborhood and for the greater San Diego area. That's awesome, Josh. What do you think? The project is complete. This means so much to me. I've loved this park since I moved to Golden Hill a few years ago. I actually got married here to my husband last May. Mm -hmm. And just to see this park continue to come to life is such a blessing. Yeah, that is so awesome. And as we take a look, and I'm going to have my photographer, Christine, kind of give you a better view, a pan. Let's stand over here because part of the project includes these um, wooden bridges that are around, really making it accessible for all, no matter, you know, if you're on a bike, if you're on a wheelchair, it just makes the path, look at this, easy to access Balboa Park and makes it safer. Speaking of safe, you'll notice the fencing that's been installed along, so we're right here on 26th Street, and boy, this is a busy area. Is. This is really busy, uh, but this is definitely going to provide it uh, a much safer environment, uh, safer, much more improved. And so here we are. What's going to happen is there's going to be, be a big ribbon cutting. And you'll notice there is a little ribbon right there on the wooden bridge. That's the ribbon they're going to officially cut. We've got uh, folks here from Forever Balboa Park that are part of this. And again, four years later, this area has been improved. It's nice to report on, on improvements and, and happy stories on this Tuesday morning. The sun is out and the, this path uh, is now used, is being utilized by folks who are in the area, really connecting Golden Hill to the rest of Balboa Park, making it easy and safer for them to use. So that's the latest. We'll have another wrap-up report coming up in our 1 p.m. broadcast. Guys, we'll send things back to you for now. Looks pretty cool. Elizabeth, thank you.